Hello everybody, it's been a while since we did a video of a quick how to. Mm, that's a cool introduction. Okay, so today I'm gonna show you how to rip DVDs. Now before you go we go in depth, this video uh includes both apps. Of course it's used two apps. These two apps are you have to pay for them. Now I'm gonna do in the future if people requested how to rip DVDs for free for Mac. Now of course you have gonna have the, these two apps, Movie I DVD Ripper and iDVD. Now Movie I DVD Ripper is for uh, $20 and it's on the App Store. Just search it, I'll put the link below if I could. Uh, just install it. It's $20 is not much considering that it does a very good job and you can really get like useful things out of it. Now let's start. So launch Movie Eye, and of course this is the, what it looks like. Now before we get started, I don't have any DVDs right now, but let's demonstrate. For example, this is is a DVD, and you just drag it over here. Of course, yeah, no, it's not a DVD. Okay, so you just drag it over here, and you'll have a, a video over here. Uh, afterwards, please make sure that you have move, uh, MP4 and Apple TV. Now, there's two reasons for that. Number one, if you're going to export it after that to iMovie to edit some things, uh, this is the best uh, option. So you don't have to convert it. Uh, number two, because it will give you the best best quality uh, you can find. Afterward, after that, you just put the output folder. So let's say disk and convert. Now it will take, depending on your how many RAMs your Mac is, but it will take about 30 minutes depending also on how big the DVD is. After that, you go to iDVD and now if you're gonna make um, a lot of DVDs, for example, it's a family, it's a work project. So whatever you will have in order, you have to make a DVD, just create a new project. That way, whenever you uh, launch your, your your Mac or uh, whenever you want you can just double click the folder and get the file or what I do is that for small one-time use DVDs I go to magic I DVD which is a quick way to do folders of DVDs now let's name the test okay and afterwards you hit modern no of course you can choose but I prefer modern because it's a more professional look to it and you drag whatever uh, you ripped from the DVD. Uh, you drag it over here, of course, if it was parts or you want to join a couple of movies, you don't have to import to a movie editor, just drop them over here. And afterward, you, you can drop photos, so when you have the screen selection or the intro, you can see the poster of the movie or pictures of the actors or whatever. Or, uh, and sorry, you can uh, choose a music for the screen selection, but just at the beginning, of course, which we chose uh, Modern, if you don't like their music. Afterward, you hit Burn. Now, of course, I don't have a DVD, but it will probably show an error, but anyway. Yep, see, inserts a DVD, which I don't have. Uh, let's close okay so that was a quick quick very quick how to rip dvds a very easy two steps uh very quick and uh, now if you do not hi have iDVD or you could not afford to have to download movie i uh, dvd ripper please comment below if i gathered more than five people saying that it cannot uh, afford that i will for sure make a video a complete video on how to rip a dvd completely for free high quality best way uh, thank you for watching if you have any any questions please feel free to comment below see you in my next video